Yeah, all good. Good morning. morning. Got builders in the corner. <laughs> Quietly eating bacon sandwiches. Yeah, yeah. And we've got builders in. Hey. Right, guys. So when we did um, the dumbbell session last week, um, we ran out of time to do biceps and back, um, which was a really good combination, actually. So we've got, um, we've got our shoulders, our triceps, and our chest done to this upper area. Uh, so we're just going to get the biceps and the back done today. So we're going to do a bicep exercise straight into a uh, back exercise. I'll go first. I'm looking to get 12 to 15 reps on my biceps. Then I'm going to get 12 to 15 reps on my back. I'm going to step out. Hannah's going to step in. We've got a selection of weights. Right? So as always, though, obviously we've got the luxury of having that selection of weights. If you guys haven't, right, and your weights are particularly light, just really slow things down. Just go really nice and slow on it. If your weights are particularly heavy, just push yourself to failure. Right? So if you can only get six reps because your weight's particularly heavy, that's fine. You can't ask your body any, anything else than that. I'm going to get cracking right into this morning, so there's not really much um, in the way you can do for a bicep and back um, warm-up without kind of doing pull-ups and, and chin-ups and things like that, which obviously we haven't got the luxury of that. So I'm going to start light. That will be, be kind of my warm-up. So I'm going to go with fives to begin with. And what I'm going to do then is I'm going to go for a nice close grip Bicep curls. So I'm going to bring the hands in nice and close. I'm just going to bring them up and down for 15. All right. Then all I'm going to do is go slight bend in the knees, bent over position, keep my chin up. All right. So back nice and straight. And I'm just going to squeeze the shoulder blades. Remember, you're trying to go out to three and nine o'clock. Right. You're going to try and go straight out and squeeze those shoulder blades together. Okay. I'm going to start with these. As soon as I'm done, step out. Hannah's going to go. So let's go for it. One. Five. Good. Last ten for me. Seven. Good. That's the squash I was supposed to drink last night. Four, three, two, one. Good. And squeeze. Back in. Three. Don't just fly for it. Four. Good, guys. That's five. Stay with that pace if you can. Four. And rest. Hannah's going to go. Hannah's going to start with the five. Let's get curl. Keeping them both together. That's it. Really pull your shoulder blades. Face back. Just trying to keep them back the whole time and pinch these shoulder blades together. Shut the internet out. Morning, Sadie. Katrina's watching you this morning. Morning, Rebecca. Morning, Dave. George Pengetti. You watching or doing it? Lovely, good. Morning, Dave, Jack, Anna Page, Mel. Good on, Rich. Tracy, Georgia. Hey, Felicity. That keeps cutting out, guys. I'm going to move away from it because I'm... I'm making it cut out. Good, Hannah, nice work. So, one more set for me then. We're going to do these in sets of three today, so we've got quite a few different movements that I want to try and do. I'm going to push that there for the tens or the last one. Okay, so 12, 15, or failure. That's five. That's five. Two left. Good. My last one here. Five. Last 
Okay, last five guys. Good work, two. And rats, yeah. Lovely. Back up other flies, nice work. Right out to the sides, good squeeze. Just over a bit more. Four, so keeping the shoulder, hip nice and aligned, squeezing this point. Good work, seven. the middle point of the clock, then you're going to go 11 and 2. So then we're going to go bent over position, okay, we're just going to pull and we're going to get our elbows in 90 degrees. Right, so side on, and we're just pull, squeeze there. So rather than going out wide like a bent over fly, we're now just doing a bent over row for a squeeze at that point. You don't need to go any further, okay? Let's go. Five, same rep range there, 12 to 15. Ten. Go on, now push that last five. Four. Three. Two. And bent over position. Both together and squeeze. One. Back together. Two. Don't rush it. Three. Four. Eight. Nine. Two. And I'm resting. There we go. Hammer's going in. Okay guys, so a good point to make also, doubles, you can always at the end, a couple of individual ones. Alright, so as we're both going together, put those arms up nice and straight. So if you've only just joined us, we're on the second exercise, hammers on our first set. Good, up, squeeze, nice work. That's it, so it's nice and slow, let's use... Nice work. That's five then, guys. Push it with me. Good. Grab all your weights if you're with me. Let's go. So as soon as Hannah steps out, we're ready to go. All right. Three. Second set of three. Four. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Come on, then. Let's push for five. Okay, I'm going to go. Individuals. Four. Three, ah, one, and row, oh, good, slowly down, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, ten, last five for me, two, and I'm rest, set left if you were me then, Guys, nice work. Great stuff. We've got Ruth with us. Good, mate. Well done. We've got Donna with us this morning. Donna, how are you? Haven't seen you for ages. Nice work. Morning, she's going to be um, putting the mitts on for the boys. I'm gonna get her on the shovel. Can I drop that on you? I'm Listen, I've already, I've already booked you out for the ease, boys. <laughs> Total of five pounds an hour. I've got my own job, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you won't want me then. Okay, twist and let's go. He's laying one. That's five. Six. Seven. And come on, all five. Let's go for four individual then. Three, two, and hit 
the road. Last set on the road. Yeah, maintain that bend in the knees. Last five. Four, three, two, hammers in. Resting I am. Cool. Last set for hammer then. Two exercises in, guys. Warm in the garden, guys. Make sure you keep the fluid going down. If you are outside in your garden, don't underestimate those fluids going in. Nice good work, that. Good extension on those elbows. See how hands get in our elbow nice and straight every time at the bottom of that movement. So she's really strengthening, stretching, sorry, and lengthening that muscle. Good. Good range of movement on the nose as well. Great stuff, guys. How many? Lovely, good. Right, guys. So, we're going to go into our third exercise. Just important to note, though, on the biceps, okay? The elbow only moves in one uh, dimension, okay? So, the bicep. Now, you can go wide grip, close grip, oh, sorry, regular grip, close grip. You can do them from up here, you can do them from up here. Ultimately, the elbow is still only hinging on the same point. Okay, so actually it's quite an easy movement. Yeah, uh, above the head, we can actually move a little bit towards the rear. That joint will only go that way. So it's actually quite a boring muscle group to work. However, that's why we just try to vary up all the different things that we can do. We can change that by turning the grip around. You can go that way, that way. You can go overhand grip and try and do things from different angles. So what we're going to do on this one is a hammer curl. So similar to what we did with those for those close grip ones at the start. But this time we're going to come from the hips and down, like a strike in a hammer. All right, so we're just bringing them up into the shoulders and all the way down again. Well, now, right, as you start to fatigue, people tend to start doing this. Okay, and they go into a swing motion. I want everything to stay still, apart from that elbow joint, which we're going to keep on nice and controlled. Okay, then all we're simply going to do is that bent over position again. We're going to turn the palms away and we're going to pull them to the hips. Four, three, just one into individuals, two, because I was about to fail there. Last one, and good, palms away. And go. So I'm going to drop to the sevens. Ten, that's five. Two. And one, nice work. Okay, so it's important to note that as my grip strength. So these are on the hammer curl and going into that row. I'm aware of when to put that weight down. Put a few more there, but I've probably been using different muscles. Nice. Keep it up. 
Lovely. Good. So have a second set coming into the second set then guys and I'm going to hit my third and final set on this one before we change the exercise. Starting to fatigue now, so we're just going to count the right arm up and twist up, twist down that position. We're looking at 12 to 15, okay? But I'm only going to count my right arm in front of us, and we're going to go up with the elbow, up with the elbow. So the elbow goes higher than the hand. We're getting an upright row, okay, which is going to hit our trapezius muscles, which make up part of the shoulder, but the large part of our hammer. If you just come here a second, large part of the back, okay? So trapezius muscles here, up into the neck, and then down to the center part of the back. So we're going to work all this area here with that upright row. Okay, first set for me then, three sets on, we're stretching after this one guys. Shoulder blades back, so set yourselves first, let's go, one, two, nice work, up, twist, four, really get that palm up into your shoulder, five, eight, okay that's ten, okay I've got the last five on my right, Two, one, finish on the left, nice work, into the row, one, two, so come on. elbow higher than the hand every time, five, that's ten for me then, good, last five, hand ready, four, if you're working hand to get your weights ready, three, Two, let's go. The two sets left if you're working with me, then we're stretching after that. Good hands. Good work. How many? Seven. Good, that's twelve. Last three. Three on the right, we're counting. Nice. Quick shake out. Good. Nice. Oh, I just get my fucking Three. Don't eat something in the demo. Six. Go on, get that over right up. Last five then, looking with hands. On 
going to try the tens. Give work two. Finishing, lovely. Good, nice work, hands out. Let's go, straight into it. that pace up, eight, keep the form, no swinging of the hips, control it on the way down, nine, again that's ten, come on now, we've got five left, five, five, five. good, squeeze for three, two, one, nice work, up right row, let's go. Come on, now, let's go. Four ten. Eight. Seven. That's five. Four. Three. Two. One. Finishing on left. Good. I'm out. I've only got one set to do. Then hands on the second set. One set left if you're working with me. Almost done, guys. A couple of minutes of work. We'll stretch those bicep muscles, stretch those back muscles. Sorry if I've not interacted much on here today, guys, but every time I seem to go near to it, I keep um, knocking the signal out. Donna Gilbert's watching. Tim Page is with us. Chris Howie's with us. Bones is with us. Ben May's watching. See you soon, Ben. Laura, how are we doing? Good, Hannah. Nice work. Good, Hans. Great work. How many? Lovely. Good answers. We're going to go to that upright row then. Last exercise to hand the second set. We've got one set left if you're with me. Great work. Come on, keep that going. Good hand. Awesome. How many? Ten. Lovely guys. Come on, Anna. Five left on the right. Good, three, two, beautiful, one on the right, one on the left, and good, if you're with me then let's get going, last Saturday, shoulder blades back, let's go. Four, five, nice work, come on Anne, we've got ten on the right. Ten. Last five on the right. Four. Ah, three. Two left. Last one on my left. Get it. Let's go. Up, right, right, right arm. One. Two. Three. Four. And five. Nice work. Come on in. Ten on the right. Six, keep it nice and close to the body now. I'll start to let mine get a little bit far away from my body then. Three. Last one on the left and rest. Good. Last set for the panel then. Let's go for it. Uh, great stuff. It's particularly hot out here again this morning, guys. Like I said, make sure you get fluid down. Breakfast right down here after this. If you've done this on an empty stomach this morning, it's nice high protein breakfast. Eggs on toast. Turkey burgers, yeah. <laughs> nice work. 
Matthew Bacon. Good, nice work, Hans. Good, try not to swing now, keep those shoulders nice and still. Good. Go on, smashing it. Good teeth, go. How many? Lovely. Go on then, last tip, stop nice and straight. Beautiful. Okay guys, so if you're working with Hannah, don't go anywhere, we're going to go straight into a stretch soon as she's finished. So if you've been working with her, just ditch your weights down, right in. to one side. Okay, drop down onto your knees, guys. Yeah, Hannah's complaining a little bit there about her wrist. I don't know if anyone else felt that. So what we're going to do is turn back okay, and sit the thumb into the heels. You're trying to drive the inside of the elbow towards your camera, towards your screen. We're going to get a nice stretch through those wrists, up through the forearms, up through the tendon there that sits in between the forearm and the bicep. Just get a nice stretch through those. We'll go for another 10 seconds. Good, five, four, three, two. Good, hands under the shoulders, hips to the floor. Let's get a nice stretch into your lower back and really pull your shoulder blades back. Right, so pull your shoulder blades back, pin them together. We're only gonna go 15 seconds in this one and we're gonna drop the thumb onto the heels. Five, two, thumb onto the heels. Okay, and then walk, curl, number 10 there. Good work, five, four, three, just a quick, quick one. I'd like to say thank you very much. Thank you very much. See you cooking tonight. And then uh, legs on Thursday. Cheers, guys. Have a good one.